Hello, I'm Dave, Head of Training for Lavazza Coffee UK. Firstly, I'd like to welcome you to the world of Lavazza Amodo Mio, where your true Italian coffee experience can really begin. You've chosen to watch the Fantasia tutorial, and in a few moments, I'm going to guide you through everything you need to know to get the very best out of your machine. Setting up your machine. Ensure your machine is on a stable, level surface. Fill the water tank with fresh, cold water to the max line. Plug your machine into the mains and switch on the power at the socket. Turn the machine on with a gentle press on the touchscreen panel. When using your machine for the first time or after a period of inactivity, draw some fresh water through the machine. To do this, place a vessel under the coffee spout, ensure there is no capsule present and press the coffee lungo button. Allow the machine to perform one full cycle. You can either discard this water or use it to pre-warm your cups. Preparing an espresso. Squeeze the front of the cup rack and pull towards you, removing the rack. Then line up with the high setting and push till it clicks into place. Place your espresso cup onto the cup rack. Select your preferred capsule. Push the silver loading lever away from you. Insert the capsule and pull the lever all the way forward back into the starting position. Press the espresso button. This will give you a pre-dosed 30 ml shot of espresso. This recipe is going to prepare a cappuccino with extra froth. Using your choice of milk, fill the frothing jug to the second icon. For fresh milk, ensure it is fridge cold, 4 to 5 degrees centigrade. Soya, goats, almond and UHT can also be used. You can add more or less depending on your preferred cup size. Push the frothing unit into place until the lights illuminate. Select your desired level of froth. We are selecting the up arrow for extra froth. Up arrow for extra frothy cappuccino. No arrow for cappuccino and downward arrow for cafe latte. Then press the icon on the machine which corresponds with your chosen milk volume. For this drink we are selecting the middle button. Pour your hot, frothed milk into your chosen glass. And place onto the cup rack. Extract an espresso directly on top. Stir before enjoying. Cold drinks. You can make milkshakes and cold coffees with your Lavazza Fantasia machine. Just follow the earlier procedure, but when selecting your milk icon on the machine, press and hold until the snowflake illuminates. This is about a three second hold. Setting the coffee dose buttons. 
You can set the Fantasia to give your preferred coffee dose. You can record volumes between 20 and 100 ml. Simply insert a capsule, press the button you wish to set and hold your finger down on the button whilst the coffee extracts, removing it when you have reached the desired volume. Cleaning and maintenance. Once you've made approximately 10 coffees, you will need to dispose of the used capsules and wastewater. Simply remove the collection unit, separate and dispose of the contents. These parts are dishwasher safe or can simply be rinsed and replaced. The stainless steel cup rack is not dishwasher safe and should be hand washed. Descaling your machine. The Fantasia is equipped with a descale warning light. This icon will illuminate orange when descaling is required. To descale your machine, pour a suitable liquid descaling solution into the water tank and fill up to the max line. Follow the specific manufacturer's instructions with regards to required volumes. These will be detailed on the descaling bottle's label. Then place a large vessel, at least one litre, under the coffee spout and ensure there is no capsule present. To activate the machine's auto descale program, press and hold both the espresso and cafe lungo button. Descaling will automatically begin and run for 30 minutes. When complete, remove, rinse, fill and replace the water tank and run water through the machine to flush out any descaling solution residue. This will take approximately half a tank. The descaling light will go off and the process is complete. Cleaning the frothing unit. The frothing jug and whisk can be placed in the dishwasher, but for an extra clean, with the frothing jug attached and empty, activate the frothing function and allow the unit to steam clean for approximately 10 to 15 seconds. Setting water hardness. The Fantasia is equipped with a water hardness setting. You can adjust this to correspond with the hardness of the water in your area. Press and hold the large cappuccino and latte buttons simultaneously. The small cappuccino button will blink. This indicates high hardness setting. Press the large cappuccino button for medium hardness and the latte button for low water hardness. To accept these settings, press the on off button. Energy save mode. The Fantasia is equipped with an auto cutoff energy saving feature. This can be programmed to initiate after 9 or 30 minutes of inactivity. To adjust this, press and hold the large cappuccino and small cappuccino buttons simultaneously. To set to 9 minutes, press the small cappuccino button and to adjust to 30 minutes, press the large cappuccino button. To accept these settings, press the on off button. Fantasia Plus Extra Features with the Fantasia Plus, you can adjust the temperature of your coffee. Simply press the minus button for a normal temperature between 79 and 83 degrees, or if you like your coffee extra hot, press the plus button, which will brew your coffee at 95 degrees. The Fantasia Plus also has a handle on the milk frother for easy removal and pouring. For any further help using your Fantasia machine, you can contact AEG Customer Services. For any coffee related queries, you can contact Lavazza Customer Services.